Welcome guys to night at prediction number two from WrestleMania 40. This is gonna be the continuation of the first video and we're gonna predict in WrestleMania night two. And this is a whole other day that we're filming. Just happen to wear the same thing. <laughs> Um, no, it's not a cafe. It's literally the next day wearing the same clothes. <laughs> no, that's just kidding. It's the right we did not bid <laughs> for the bit. <laughs> for the bit. No, you're just kidding. It's the same day we recorded. So yeah, so if you see our first video, we're gonna go match by match by uh, according to Wikipedia order, and we're gonna predict who's gonna win this match. But this night is gonna be a, this we, this is gonna be a shorter video because it's, this night in night two is gonna be a shorter match. Uh, so the first mat, the first night was seven matches. The night two is gonna be six matches. So it's gonna be more time to uh, make wrestling content and less time to predict. So here we go with our first. Match. One, two, and three. What you got? Money in the bank. <laughs> <laughs> hey. <laughs> that's 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 a nice. That's a nice. Uh, yeah, I smell a cash in baby. Yeah, this is a cash in. I mean, so if you guys didn't know, they announced a Scotland show in night, uh, night the Clash of the Castle too in Scotland, Glasgow, the home city of Drew McIntyre. So we are gonna see him be crowned there. And not now because we have a money in the bank still run, running around and it's overdue and hopefully it's gonna cash in this night with I think it's gonna be a whole prediction. My prediction is that Drew, Drew is gonna cheat and win the title and CM Punk is gonna interfere and give him a go to sleep or something like that and he's gonna uh, and Seth Rollins is gonna stomp him and Drew, McC Drew McIntyre is uh, sorry Damien Priest is gonna come and cash in his money in the bank and he's gonna win his uh, glorious night in WrestleMania. It's the only thing I can see possible going after this night. So like my whole experience with like thinking about these predictions was where does the money in the bank fit in? Is he gonna cash in? Is he gonna give it to Drew? Drew has been on fire. But CM Punk is here. CM Punk... Uh, will be at the announcer's desk and he will definitely play a role which will get Drew distracted or he will hit him with something and it will be a uh, one, two, oh! Whose music is that? J J J Judgment Day? Yes, that we will get a cash in. But I I'm gonna jump a little forward, a little into the future and we'll talk about money in the bank pay-per-view itself and we would either see Gunther winning the money in the bank which i believe he should win the rumble so i i will take him out of that equation because that's where, that's where i'm gonna put place him right now and we're gonna put drew mcintyre winning the money in the bank and cashing in at home uh... Uh, the first is first then. First? Yeah. <laughs> okay, then not. Clash of the Castle. But then he will win uh, uh, at, at home then. Which kind of sucks because who, no matter who wins, will get, get a short uh, reign as champion. It's kind of like, yeah, with everything happened with Cody, CM Punk coming back. Uh, it's kind of uh, a, a pain in the ass situation, but man, this is that's the only thing I can see we can do with the money in the bank. No more failed cash in. It will it will get successfully cashed in. Yeah. One, two, three, go. Oh boy, sorry. <laughs> I did it the wrong side. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I got Bailey. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm just a huge Bailey fan. Uh, yeah, I, no I, mistake. I need, I need to. <laughs> his pick, his pick. It, it, it's Bailey. It's Bailey. It's Bailey. No explanation here. ESK is a missing wrestler, but okay, come on. Even people who was hating on Bailey, I was supporting Bailey, and I'm not gonna stop right now. Fuck. Oh, I, I mean, f for me, like. 
I was so positive. I didn't have to write a name. I know who, who Mans was going to pick. <laughs> it's going to be Bailey. The whole story, the whole damage control. Uh, we still can't forgive Bailey for uh, actually doing a triple, quadruple homicide on uh, live TV with the inflatable uh, guys. But, you know, it's kind of like wrestling. You could get arrested for a week and then you, know, you come out, you can assault someone and not get arrested. So... <laughs> But it's Bailey. It's Bailey. She's it's uh, for out of all the 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 women who get praised, she's the one who's overlooked the most. And honestly, she's amazing. She's she's great, and she deserves her flowers. And she's my favorite wrestler. So Bailey's gonna win. God, I'm gonna pick her every day of the week. <laughs> <It's just laughs> anyway. Two, one. Yeah! <laughs> you already know what it is. LA Knight. Yeah! Mr. Future Money in the Bank champion for, winner for me, Mr. LA Knight. This guy, this guy is super over. He's not winning in WrestleMania. He's just criminal. A wrestler for which if he books. To we lose. had a WrestleMania at LA and we didn't have LA Knight. Mr. Los Angeles Knight himself. So, and AJ Style, man, nah, that's gonna be a great match. Uh, of course, and bro, uh, AJ Styles also um, elevating term right now. Is this is gonna be not short of a good, uh, not short of a bad match. It's gonna be an awesome match. AJ is gonna uh, put his heart out. LA Knight is gonna put his heart out, and yes, from Japan, from uh, uh, TNA Impact, from WWE, he delivers. AJ Styles is gonna give us an amazing match and Matt, this man looks swole as hell now so hey looking dangerous so it's gonna be i think this is gonna be one of the match that uh people might sleep on uh for day two but i think this is gonna be a great match one two three we got Kevin, Kevin Mania. He is going to win this because Randy Orton doesn't need a title. Logo Paul is a douchebag. And, and the only likable guy he has here is Kevin Owens. So I'm just supporting Kevin Owens all the way. Yeah, listen, Kevin Owens been done dirty. He's someone who deserves to get a run with the uh, World Heavyweight Champion. He's someone who should have gotten uh, a run with the the universal champion uh another run then uh I, I i believe the story with him and uh paul him losing by disqualification so never got pinned by a douchebag uh orton also someone who came back amazing physique uh like Pedro said doesn't really need the win uh, but it's also gonna just put out a, a, a great fight between uh, these two people and uh, someone who will lose their title. Yeah, let's go. One, two, three. The pride. The pride. Yes. <laughs> so I, I put my uh, sleeper matches because <laughs> if everybody think ah it's, think uh, it's short notice it's uh, their feud in SmackDown wasn't that great uh, blah 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 but they going to do it in WrestleMania I uh, feel like that for street fights uh, according to Wikipedia this match is before rest, uh, main event so I say people's gonna sleep on this match but it's gonna be one of the match of the night in night two I'm not that convinced. Uh... I, I, I think it's gonna be an okay match. It's gonna be, uh, uh, it's not gonna be that much of a, a great match because I think they don't want to, even if a uh, street fight, it's a WWE street fight. We're not gonna see like Moxley uh, uh, gushing blood <laughs> like we would in AEW. It's gonna be a very uh, 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 light street fight pretty much compared to like something really you know like blood feud blood feud 
but I, I, I think this is just gonna be something that's gonna wind down the fans a bit. So when we get to Cody with all the interference, uh, 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 I'm getting uh, jumping a little ahead of myself. But when we get to the the main event, we need everyone to be alert, awake. But I think uh, the pride uh, deserves it. I feel like they've been uh, done dirty and uh, directionless for a long while. So definitely need a win Def definitely just uh, uh keep them going keep them alive oh i wonder i wonder who i will pick oh oh i i also i just, I just wonder what the shit whoa Next up to Cody, <laughs> Cody, uh, Cody, Adventure, and the Cluster Fuck. So what am I mean by that? That's we're gonna get everybody in the Ross interference. We're gonna see a lot, a lot, a lot. But I mean a lot of interference because it's a bloodline rules match. So there's gonna be no disqualification. We're gonna see maybe Seth Rollins, maybe Jimmy Uso, maybe Se uh, Jay Uso, maybe Solo Sikoa. Possibly John Cena, possibly Stone Cold, possibly Tamatonga, MGF, <laughs> possibly MJF. I don't know, but it's gonna be one hell of a ride. And <laughs> man, I'm not ready for this match. I, listen, they're, like I said, you were gonna throw everything at Cody, everyone, everyone, Solo, uh, 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 Jimmy, the Wise Man will. Put, put a foot on the rope or whatever. The Rock will, will uh, 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 get involved. Uh, 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 Rikishi is gonna do it for for the Rock. Do it for the people. It, 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 this is gonna be crazy. Uh, uh, like I, 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 you know, have to joke. Like I, I kind of really want to see MGF. Uh, uh, <laughs> it's not gonna happen. But if it does, I will be amazing. It's not gonna happen. But it would be amazing. Wow. Anyway, <laughs> this is gonna, they're gonna throw everything, like at the whole nine yards at Cody. And out of everything, they throw every single thing. This is, this time, the difference is Cody has backup. The first time around, he didn't have backup. Solo screwed him over and he lost that match. Now he has backup. So now we'll, we'll see they throw everything at Cody and Cody will prevail. And Cody will win and finally, Finally, finish that story and start a new story as your undisputed world champion. <coughs> oh man, I hope it's. Hey guys, thank you guys for watching this video. And uh, uh, there was a, a fun project between us. Uh, we're gonna, of course, I'm going to vlog the WrestleMania. We, we are living in the Netherlands, so we're gonna watch it one day later. So if you guys can stop with the spoilers, I will appreciate it. But. It's not gonna happen, so I'm going to do my best. We're gonna do our best to avoid a lot of spoilers. Technically, it's not the next day. It's already the next, next day, day when it starts. It started. So, <laughs> like I say, it's gonna happen in the late at night. Uh, we're gonna watch it in the morning of the evening. So I don't, we don't know how, but thank. Uh, we're gonna do it. So it's gonna be a hell of a ride. I'm going to vlog it, of course, because it's WrestleMania for you. And, uh, yeah, and yeah. So you're gonna see our reaction then. But this is our prediction. Guys, thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time. Peace out. Thank you for the Vinci Virus for joining me. Oh, before, before we go, this, this might not even make it. What if Cody loses? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> we don't, I don't want to talk about it. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, listen to me. Hey, hey. Zoom in, zoom in, zoom in. Uh, turn it when you're done. All right. I'm telling you, if Cody loses, if Cody does not finish that story, does not win the Undisputed Championship from Roman at WrestleMania, not SummerSlam, not after, we riot. We almost did it at uh, a ECW uh, event. If Cena had won against RVD, we was gonna riot. 
Uh, this is a whole riot. Uh, you can call us crybabies. You can call us whatever you want. But this will happen. Cody will win. Heed my words. <laughs>